Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a sit down video, a unboxing. It feels so strange to be doing one because I haven't like sat down and really filmed in a long time. But today I'm gonna to be doing an unboxing from this company called Dossier, Dossier. I'm not really sure how to pronounce it, but this is the company. They reached out to me and asked if I wanted to review a couple of their scents. And when you guys see the, the bottle, you're going to die. Like, it's so minimal, simple. You guys know I love packaging, things that are aesthetically pleasing, things that look good to the eye. So when I saw it, I was like, yes, yes, please. So this company, um, let me just tell you a bit more about them. I have my phone here because I can never, like, remember things. So they reproduce classic eye-end luxury scents at a fraction of the price, right? keeping the exact same high quality by cutting all the expenses and the infamous brand tax and all of that, which I think is good because my issue with perfume, because I like to branch out and try new ones, but they're almost $150 a bottle. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like, and I feel like throughout the year, your scents should change because obviously in the winter you should like have like a, a warmer i don't know i'm pretty sure but i like to switch up my scents and based on how i'm feeling so if i'm more in a flirty mood i want like a different sort of scent or if i want more for fresher scent i want that or if i'm more i want more floral so yeah anyways um and you know what with their company for each of the perfumes that you order and guys these perfumes are so inexpensive i personally chose three scents that i'm familiar with that way i can compare them and really tell you if it's very close to the real thing you guys know i like to budget and cut back costs wherever i can and if i can get perfume for us guys i think they're like 30 dollars per bottle i'm not even going to lie to you it's not that it's not expensive and i was really really shocked because i actually smelled them also and you cannot tell the difference so basically for each perfume you order they send you a little sample in here a little sample for you to smell first to see if you like it before opening the actual thing so let me just give you like a little overview here so each of the boxes come with a little card in here this one says thank you for choosing to discover a new scents at dossier.co you know we took inspiration from the world's most iconic scents in order to give you the chance to experiment and discover new perfumes which is like great all at a fair and transparent price which i love so the first scent that i chose was um oriental woody one and this is inspired by chanel's coco mademoiselle mademoiselle yeah i used to own this perfume a while back i just never repurchased it but i'm very familiar with the smell of it i can smell it anywhere i go i know exactly what it smells like and um so the notes for this the top notes are bergamot orange the middle notes are jasmine and rose and the base is patchouli vanilla and Vetiver. Each perfume comes with a card like this to outline the scents, the notes, whatever. And yeah, um, it came with a sample, but I want to show you guys the bottle because you're going to love it. If, you're, if you know me, you know this is right up my alley. Like, you know I love it. Get out. Okay. Oh my god. So this is the little cute bottle, and I can't wait to have these um, on my perfume tray because they just look so simple. But look at the cute little bottle, you guys. Like what and it's just like very simple plain writing plain shape i love 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 this and um yeah i'm gonna smell it i already smelled them as i said but i think they're spot on it also comes with a little sample thing here for you to sample before you open the real thing the bigger the bigger one so you sample smell and if you like it you keep it you know but if you don't you can just send it back no problems but yeah i just sprayed it and it smells exactly the same. I'm so familiar with this scent. I used to own it about two years ago. I ran through it because I loved it so much. But yeah, I'm very familiar with the smell of this. And it smells exactly the same. So that's the first scent that I got. Um, the next one that I got is Floral Number 2. Oh, I forgot to mention on their site, um, their scents are categorized by Woody, 
oriental and floral so i tried to choose one from each category that i knew that i know of that way you know i can give you guys some variety um so the next thing i chose was um, floral two and this is inspired by gucci's bloom if you guys can hear the rain outside i'm sorry like it's pouring but um yeah this one is inspired by gucci's bloom my friend's my friend wore this perfume for so long. I used to love it on her. It smelled amazing. So I decided to try it because I know this smell. But um, the top notes for this one is Ragoon Creeper. The middle notes are Jasmine Sandback and, tuber and then Tuberose. And then the base note is Iris. So let's spray this one. Again, it comes with a little sample for you to spray before you know the real thing. And I'm happy because I can just bring these in my purse. Yes, just like I remembered, um, guys, it smells like the exact same thing. There's really not much to describe about the scents because if you got the, or if you own the Gucci Bloom, or you went to the store to smell it and smell this, you cannot tell the difference. You cannot, like honestly, you can't. It's like the exact same, I mean, it's inspired by, but it's basically the same thing. I feel like with a ton of perfume places and brands in general, you're really paying for the brand name, you know? The content within the bottle is not that expensive because I know it didn't cost them anything to produce it or make it. They just want to sell it back for that price because it's sold under a brand name, you know, Gucci, Louis, Fendi, Prada, whatever. You're really buying the brand and the the label, you know? The final scent that I have here is Fresh Floral One, and this one is inspired by Versace's Bright Crystal. I, for some reason, I love this perfume so much. I just never bought it because of the bottle. I don't like that bottle it comes in. I'll put it on the screen here. I don't like that bottle. I don't think it goes with my aesthetic. So I never purchased it because of that reason. So when I saw this on the website, I literally leaped. <laughs> I could not have clicked faster. So I'm very excited to have this. I'm not gonna lie, this is like my favorite thing, but this one is inspired by Versace's Bright Crystal, as I said. The top notes are pomegranate, yuzu, and ice accord. The middle notes are magnolia, lotus, and peony. And the base notes are amber, musk, and mahogany. And um, again, it comes with a sample perfume, a little sample thing. Let's spray this. I kind of want to keep these boxes like forever <laughs> okay I love this I don't know why I just love the fresh it just smells like fresh flowers like just like this is like a definitely like a spring summer scent for me of course it's wintered out I'm still gonna wear it but um, I just really love this perfume I always envision myself as wearing this on like I don't know, like vacation or something I really really like this um so yeah these are the three scents that i chose i can't wait to take a photo of these and just post on my instagram because i know they're just gonna just be so aesthetically pleasing um but yeah these are the perfumes and thank you for dossier for reaching out and sending me these perfumes to try i'm so excited and guys they're really not expensive so if you're looking to branch out with perfumes or if you're a lover of perfumes like myself definitely oh, i just want to come off the box Hey, come on. But yeah, these are the perfumes. Very excited to wear them. Um, definitely in love with all of these three scents. These are scents that I'm very familiar with, as I said. So, I mean, I know them. They're pretty, really nice. But they have so many scents on their site. Like Chanel, Coco Chanel. Um, they have black opium inspired scents they have so many inspired scents like mainstream scents that you probably smell every day on people very common scents if you are into that so you know definitely go check them out if you're looking for new perfumes and fragrances but yeah i'm definitely obsessed let me open the bottle because i haven't even opened them because i've been using the the samples but this is what the bottle looks oh my god so adorable so 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 nice um this is what it looks like i really really love it um yeah this is the <sighs> my god i just love that i love it it smells so expensive 
All right, so that's it for the unboxing, you guys. And thank you again for thank you again to Dossier's team for sending me these products. I really, really love them, and I'm so excited. And yeah, that concludes today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any additional questions, feel free to just leave a comment, and I'll be happy to answer them. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.